WFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of Delray Beach, Florida on 2222 out there. That's a, a pretty cool day. But if we take a look at the markets out here, we've got a slightly mixed bag. The Dow's up 138, S&P 29, NASDAQ 100 is up 58 points. That's four tenths percent. Russell, though, is down one full percentage point. She's trading out at 2030. Semis are up one and six tenths percent, 57.82. Gold trading out at 1808. That's up eight bucks. Silver trading out at 22.73. That's 13 percent or six tenths percent to the up side big move out here in natural gas she is pre oh no charts well that's a problem now you're just looking at the running man sorry about that uh, folks uh, you know i thought i had it under control but here is the under control thank you inside the uh, den so now we've got out here big move inside of natural gas up two bucks trading out of six dollars and 26 cents out here let's go spend a little time and take a look at our indice charts see what they're saying out here we'll begin by take a look at the dow as soon as we get this popped up on your screen voila there you go so we're taking a look at the Dow. What we've got is a, a nice rose momentum indicator bottom, a buy the D point bottom, bar number four of a TD9 count. For all intents and purposes, the Dow should go target the 36,513 level. That is a TD9 count breakdown area. The S&P should do the same thing, although its price target would be 47,44, bar number four today. Speaking of going to the bar, it's the NDX 100. It's having a good old time out here, and it wants to go target 15,990. If we look at the Russell 2000, even though it's having a bad day, as long as price stays above 2005, we're 2032 right now. It wants to go target 2210. Now, it doesn't mean that it's going to get all the way up there. There could be a topping pattern that gets in uh, the way uh, between, could be a TD9 count between then and now. But those are the signals for those four instruments. The semis, they're having a beautiful day out here above the top of it, or above its oscillator and change line yesterday and today. That suggests that this could make a move to the 3840 level. The Dow Transports, even though I don't really have a great read here, this might be targeting 16,618. The market should continue to move higher as long as the spot volatility index remains below 2217. That number will change by pennies. Uh, 2217 is the 50 day exponential moving average. So that's what's going on there. Uh, there was a question that came in that I didn't see uh, when we did the Trader's Edge show. And the question was Is PayPal a buy? We take a look at the charts here for PayPal. No way, Jose. It's below all profile levels. Big volume move to the downside. Folks, stay tuned. Your favorite polar bear, David White's up next. We'll look forward to seeing you tomorrow on Terrific Thursday. Have a wonderful, wonderful Wednesday.